Hey everyone, real quick, Oakland needs to establish an official policy that sanctions diversity. I went to the alley tonight and encountered something I've never encountered in the history of the city of Oakland, in my history of the city of Oakland. In fact, something like this happened maybe remotely once in 1994, but I'll cut to the chase. There's a guy calling his wife, Layla. Uh, she's from England and they both sound like they're from England. She's a student at Cal, and he's an engineer, he says. He's roaring drunk. I'm talking to a couple of my friends. She comes in, and you know how you mix and talk with people in the bar. And husband comes up, and he basically says he hasn't seen a black person before to me. And he asks me eight times what my name is on different occasions. I'm trying to get him to focus off that. And he also wants to focus on the obvious like racial issue that he's got going on in his head. And he says, uh, so you're, I've never seen a black person. You're black and you're black and you're a shithead and you're this and that. And he's taunting me. And I'm, I finally said to Layla, I said, you need to get your husband under control. Because if she didn't, I'm sending the guy to jail. No, I don't get in the bar fights because then I'm in trouble. And that's a lesson to those of you who would react in that way. You have to think about the consequences of what you would, might do under, in those situations. But I told her specifically, I said, you need to get your husband under control. And to her credit, she did. But I've never had that happen in my history of the city before. Sure, maybe there was like one woman who was drunk and racially offensive and, the, and was thrown out of the bar. That happened, wow, five years ago. All right, five years. But when I take Colin and then I match it with a city auditor's report, where Courtney Ruby singled out two black council members for violating the city charter in terms of directing staff and so on, allegedly a charge that could be and should be leveled against every single council member, current and pre past and present. Awful. And it sent a, racial, a racist message and it was picked up by racist websites. Unacceptable. So... Then I've got another example where I'm leaving the alley on the night that Keonti Campbell was murdered at Art Murmur, and these I'm getting I get in the cab and I say to the cab, please take me to uptown. And these white men on to the side passing by the alley say, Oh, black guy getting in the cab, going to the uptown. You know, I've never heard that in Oakland. All that happened this year. And this is just May twenty fifth. What's next? We need to get this under control before guys like that antagonize the wrong black person and something really, really bad happens, okay? We've never had that in Oakland, and we're not going to have it in the future, and we've got to make sure it doesn't happen again. I'm done.